time. So afternoon for me. Uh, we're gonna see if we can find a match. So, uh, as you could tell, I'm streaming my matches again, right? And so I was able to post the video to YouTube a, a day or two ago, maybe yesterday, I believe, uh, showing how long it took to find a match against the same opponent over and over and over again because of this hidden ELO rating system they have in head-to-head. -head. Uh, foot, Ultimate Team, if you're in Division 1, you only play Division 1, 2, and 3. If you're in Division 10, you only play 10, 9, and 8. If you're in Division 5, you play 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So it's, it's plus 2, minus 2 of current league in foot. And that's what you're restricted to. If you go back to my history of all the matches I've played, you'll actually notice that I play like Division 8 while in Division 2. Or when I was Division 8, I played Division 5, opponent, uh, Division 4 opponent. And that's because of, again, the way that this works out. I'll show you very quickly. So, I'm Division 2, right? And I played this guy yesterday. Uh, and he's 39, 5, and 4. And he's Division 3 today. Now, yesterday, he was like Division 5 or 6. And if we take a look now at leaderboards and we just go to let's see is it overall no you go to top 100 and then we go to weekly uh, sorry weekly okay so this is the one opponent they tried to make me play over and over and over again and Eiffel this week alone he's pretty much winning non-stop seven losses so a very good opponent he's now number four in the world <clears throat> for the week he was number two yesterday our connection was no good we both agreed to forfeit whatever and now here is this opponent uh so he's 39 wins and four losses uh i was able to deliver one of those four losses that he has now it kept making me play him and our connection was just not very good it was good enough to finish a match, but it didn't feel that great to me. So I originally made this uh, playlist with Italy to get to Division 1 because I was in the ultimate team mindset where you just climb up the ranks in your division and getting to Division 1 essentially means you're playing everyone in the same division constantly to get to Division 1. Uh, head to head is completely different. I created this mindset of, you know, I'll get to Division 1 with Italy. It's actually, I should change it. It's really not getting to Division 1 with Italy. It's maintaining top 50 with Italy. Because uh, if you look at all the opponents I've played in the leaderboard, they're all top 50 in the world. Uh, whether you look at the weekly, the monthly, or overall. Now, I haven't played the game in two months. So, you know, it's, I don't know where those people stand now, but. Um, as I was playing the game, I kind of picked up on the fact that I kept playing like the same opponents over and over again, and I kept checking the leaderboards, and they're still top 50. So there's this hidden ELO system in the background that chooses who I play against, as opposed to Ultimate Team, which I played very heavily last year, where if I was Division 1, I only played against Division 1 opponents, sometimes Division 2, but mostly Division 1. Uh, and there was no hidden ELO system where it tries to find you an opponent that they believe is good. Uh, give me one second, I'll be right back.
All right, I'm back. Uh, wife was just nagging me about something. So again, head to head is just different than ultimate team. I may actually play uh, an ultimate team match after this head to head match. So last night I said, you know what? Since it's technically not Italy to division one, it's really Italy staying top 50. Why don't I just use a team that I want to play as? So I tried using um, AC Milan, which is a four and a half star rated team. Could not find a match for five hours. Just couldn't find one. So Italy is a five-star team. Um, now, the players don't really... Oh, sorry. Milan is a four-star team now, not a four and a half. So Italy is a five-star team, the national team. So I believe so. Is that right? So still five-star team. Uh, the way that Head to head works as it tries to find you someone in that same star rating. Um, what I've noticed with the top 50 players in the world is that none of them use four and a half star teams. They all use uh, Barcelona, Bayern, the French national team, Real Madrid, uh, Manchester City, notably yesterday. You could pretty much watch all my previous matches, it's, it's against all five star rated teams, and they're very similar. I think Barcelona has the most appearances in all my matches. So, I could not find a match at all with Milan. I wanted to use them, and I don't mind playing against a 5-star team with the 4-star team, because I personally don't think that the Italian national team is actually very good. Um, yes, Ferrari has a high overall rating, but that's because of his international... He's truly an 81 rated card. He gets five additional overall stats for his international status. You can find this on like Foothead or Footbin or any of those uh, foot websites. They'll tell you how many bonus points they get due to international standing. Um, and that is done for two reasons. Number one, uh, it's to inflate the price of cards. Uh, so a card that's really like an 80 rated card, but if they're known for being very good at the international level for so many years, like uh, Cruz, uh, you know, I think he's like 88 rated uh, with like 45 pace. Again, they give him a plus five because of how many years he played on that German national team. So, uh, we're going to look for a match. Uh, I believe I fixed my squad file. So that it no longer says that the squad file is broken. Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. Again, it's yeah, absolutely great. ideal. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's Paris Saint-Germain against not. Italy. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Always my favourite time before. of the week, spending time Scary. with you at games. Four we times. should be in for a belter here with not these two. Lorenzi on the ball. Jorginho. Getting a little late. Leonardo yeah. Spinazzola. Oh, and uh, no penalty there. Okay. Oh, oh okay. This is going to be a goal. And this is going to stop. And that is how to win the ball back from your opponent. I was actually going to take a yellow card there. Jorginho. I think I got the ball. Verratti now. Van Lat. Neymar. And a throw in forthcoming. I guess so he and that's gone out of play for what will be a goal kick. Or what? Try to get it to Lorenzo. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. All right. Well, that shouldn't really happen from a throw-in. Lorenzo Insigne. Someone get into Jorginho. space, Carly. Get into space. 
What the? Here's Icardi. You just saw Jorginho pass the ball to Varela, who was wide open, and Varela said, no, I don't want it. Get your own pass. There might be some uh, anger between the team. They might not like that. It's with Lorenzi. Well, they no longer have the ball. Oh, I got the ball and first the before he felt he had to blow the whistle. Else. Oh, yeah, no, yeah, I get the ball. The left foot wraps around and gets the ball. No yellow. And they'll get ready for the throw in. One thing I noticed about playing against PSG, I know a lot of people focus on how many attackers they have. Francesco Acerbi. They're separate midfielders. Waltzing under the pressure. Good. And now um, they're trying to go forward. AI controlled defense. What I mean by that is Verratti you try to now. pass it, Lorenzo and they Insigne. automatically block the passes with their feet uh, without being controlled, like there. You just saw. The guy Di was Maria. not controlling that player. Uh, but they're probably the best team in this game oh, at, surely. Neymar! at a blocking goal. passes He's without being controlled. A without a doubt, the easiest team to play with in this game. Because uh, you don't have to actually. Do anything. Center midfielder is in the back line. Going to do it for you. Jorginho, Barella, Federico Bernardeschi, Verratti, Verratti, a and, goal! Uh, Real we noticed that. A back and forth type of game. Look back at that now play. I knew level. that. I had numbers in the box. Um, now, I couldn't deliver it on the floor to anybody. Well, here it is again, Derek. Let's be honest. Floor, he's not going to win goal of the season. Right, but you have to be in the right place at the right time. And you have to be calm. So, a second. level contest. 1-1. One, one. Now, there we guess the pass manually. And we don't like it. Because I don't know why. It's with Lorenzi. Gay. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. Bernardeschi. Leonardo Spinazzola. Verratti. Well, they get the ball once more. Well, they were clearly on the receiving end, so a free okay, kick I is next. I fouled him by getting tossed out of the way. So next time I know, just don't let him push me, otherwise it's a foul. Got it. Noted. Jorginho, Di Maria Again, now. those those players on their team. And the referee oh, blows the whistle. Jesus it Christ is a free kick. The players on the team, they're going to keep blocking my passes automatically. That's, that's one thing that people don't realize about the Varela has it. Every time I get the ball, I will add it to Superbly read and executed. Takes the shot. Well, the post getting in the way there. Okay. I didn't. I didn't pass that. But okay. I got to clear this ball out if something feels odd to me. Just get rid of it. Again, uh, obviously, I wouldn't do that. And the so referee has given them a corner. Game is lagging uh, tremendously at the moment. No danger now. Can he find the net? I can't control my player. This is odd. Every time I get Varela the ball, has it. it freezes. And then every time he has the ball, it's not freezing. Uh, so we may be doing a, Romagnoli. a little unfair play by the opponent. It is to be a throw in. Again, every time I get the ball, there's noticeable legs. Onto like Spinazzola, the ball. and they'll have to throw it back in play. Let's see if it legs at all with him. Marquinhos. Verratti. Okay. Great side tackle to steal the ball. 
the goalkeeper yeah, relatively yeah. untroubled. Yeah, he's not, he's not going to let it. that one in, Derek. He's going to try keeping it. After taking it. He's playing extremely high pressure. As you can see, he's got five Verratti. like hits behind him. Uh, that was a through ball to Lorenzo. Again, this game is. I'm going to watch this game out and hit for a draw. Uh, it's too laggy for me to I'm giving the ball away. essentially accomplish anything I want to So let's just play for a draw. Icardi. Can he finish? Just Ooh. found wanting in terms of the finish ball. then. Should have kept it, pass it to Neymar. Again, we are so laggy. I'm starting to get a little dizzy. And taken away. He won the ball. Vanadeski. These are passes I would obviously never make. You've seen me play before. Verratti. Spinazzola. Oh, the referee allowing yellow. advantage to accrue to them. Again, why would I do that pass? Why would, why would I do that? Unless I was drunk. I could not. I was drunk last time. I'm going to shoot this. Meat and drink uh, to the man from Costa Rica. Trying to go farther, closer to the first thing. Here. Di Maria. It's an excellent attack from PSG, but will there be an end product? Can he convert? And that's fantastic goalkeeping to get uh, across and deal with the danger. The guy did a 360 pass. Yeah. Okay, perfectly chested down. Huh. I feel like if you play as PSG and you don't win, you probably suck at this game. And so it is, the first half story yeah, has been written. Sometimes I do contemplate switching to Manchester City. Uh, just a much easier team to play with, in my opinion. But I'm going to stick with Italy, as I've... Uh, Sticking with them this whole time, so pass accuracy 78%, beating him in there, and possession 61%. So I'm really dominating, essentially, I'm dominating the match. Uh, the leg, really tense battle so far, and now the second Constantly half is underway. It seems like every time I get to the middle of the pitch, the final period. Possession regained by Verratti. It's Kimpembe now. It's with Lorenzi. Spinazzola. Here's Insigne. Yeah, I can't control this game. Insigne! That's got to well, be. Well, really fine what goalkeeping. Is... Good diving stop. What? Uh, well, I was holding down the match. Cleared away. This is just the game. We're not going to score. This is Neymar. It's too laggy. Well, let's see. That pass might have Verratti's name on it. And fed back to the goalkeeper. Leonardo Spinazzola. Lorenzo Insigne. Foul there. Oh, that Free player kick awarded. Like it's already got a yellow. So now with Spinazzola. And they keep things ticking over nicely with Insigne. And what's he going to do? Well, they did have possession oh, of the ball, but the all dribble. that good work now counts for nothing. Takes the shot. Oh, yes. A goal. Get... Exactly what they were looking nice for, and he's come up with it. PSG chasing this game. Let's see if they can succeed on that front. Verratti.
unable to keep the ball. So this can't impose many tests. Francesco Acerbi. Not very tough. Lorenzi. He's playing such aggressive defense. Bernardeschi. At high pressure. This is Neymar. Which is a little frustrating. They should get fired. Now, the let's see the what stamina. they can do here. Everybody. Uh, which I agree. Should play. Because if you're watching these United playing soccer, it's a little bit of time. Verratti now. Because of their place now. Well, it's smart. Okay. A foul it most That's certainly it was. Free kick given. You do know I got a yellow. So it's good. And we got a great three tackle someone in the box. Van Lat. Verratti. The outcome is a goal a kick here. And Buffy had good defense played against him by a ground. Barella. Come on, Lorenzo. So Lorenzo could have made that one if he wanted to. I guess he did not want to. Mbappe. Icardi waits. Let that ball go to bounce. Now with Spinazzola. Here's Insigne. What the credit to them this for is, winning this back is position? Can he here, find obviously. the net? And so, the goal! as you can see, the, the way that contest. All even. they don't let the ball go out of the fence. They're on top of the ball. Oh, we've been saying for a while, Derek, haven't we, that the pressure so was mounting. It was only a matter of time before they scored. They've created a lot of opportunities, and one's finally gone in. Well, as the game has restarted, we're we'll so, yep. left to reflect uh, on four goals. 2-2. Two, two. 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 The right. referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Oh. And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Yeah, I think we're going to celebrate on that. Well, let's have another look at that. When he was lining up, I'm thinking, surely he's not going to shoot, but he did. Nope. It's a really lovely strike. He's scoring on it. from there, the though. Does get a Disappointing for PSG to concede the goal. Now let's see if they can attack with bigger. Too much power. Top pocket. I have no one to pass giving us away. Here's He's Icardi. Super solid, aggressive, high pressure defense. But the problem is the players are not getting tired. Bernardeschi. Uh, okay. Bernardeschi. Icardi. Press button. Press. Oh, it's good. All right, let's pause it. Let's get some bigger players out there for this corner kick. I don't have a good feeling about this corner kick. So now a corner. I got a bad feeling about this. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. Well, punched away by the keeper. Federico Chiesa. Immobile! And oh, a goal to delight the, the fans! Just what they were hoping for! That helps me out, that's the grace. Here's the replay. He didn't panic, did it? Decent strike, good technique, bread and butter strike, really. But it's in the back of the net. So the current scoreline, 4 2.
fresh legs. Just a simple pass to Ciro. Idrissa Gay. Barella has it. Okay, Bernadeschi had the power button on that shot meter. Held and across the touchline, so a throw in here. Seconds. And he decided not to shoot the ball. This team Barella is not has it. You can see this in the bar. Locatelli. Federico Chiesa. Now we'll just wait out the remaining minutes. Barella. And, uh, Poor touch. Should and be they no longer the have custody of the ball. Again, the passing is really off this match. We got a free kick goal by Lorenzo, so I'll take it. Marquinhos. And smart defending. Not a great challenge. Free kick here. Don't know what there was the ball in that. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. And a pretty straightforward stop for the goalkeeper there. Yeah, weak shot straight at him. No problem for the goalie. Here is Juan Bernat. Bad pass there. That's good. And that will be all. Another fantastic performance. They've added three points to their total. Is anyone going to be able to stop them? Well, some real quality out there today. The result will add fuel to the fire to those suggesting the title could be theirs this season. And on that evidence, I have to agree, to Derek. Uh, Still we'll a lot of graft to do. I'm... At the opponent. take a look at the opponent that we just played against. So we played against a guy named Tyler. Uh, Division 2 as well. 72 wins and 37 losses, so quite a good record. And then let's see if we can find Tyler on the leaderboard. We did not play against anyone who's in the top. He's not even on a leaderboard. Uh, we played this guy. L. I don't even know why he's here. He's got 30 wins and 27 losses. I have to be confused with the other L on his MP. So I guess. I guess my presumption is incorrect with that one. It was not, he's not even on any of the leaderboards. Um, he's got a good record. Not on any of the leaderboards. So we just played against like just a normal opponent. But what we're going to do, I'm going to give you a bonus episode. We're going to play some ultimate team. Uh, I don't even know if I, I think I have a full team. I actually have a I think I have a decent team, an ultimate team. Maybe give him some, some contracts. Now, uh, the negative here is that uh, the match is probably going to be uh, an easy match if we do find one. Because uh, we're in Division 10. A 9. So I give the people bonus. I got two big strikers up top.
So you find the match against uh, Joseph. Good latency. So he's got just the non rare gold team with not the best chemistry. I have a rare gold team. No special cards. Hello everyone, the weather forecasters promised us a very pleasant day for football, and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary position, and it could be a good news story, who knows, will they, at the end of business, be arithmetically safe from the drop? What a match this promises to be, Lee. Well, it was that's a strong kind of start to the season, wasn't it, Derek? They'll be looking to repeat that here Big today, and if they can make it six nothing. from six, they'll really start to believe they have a chance of the title. Let's hope we get a good game. A creative look about this. Oh, come on, In possession, Velocity gives it a go. A oh, tremendous block. Oh, the ball lost here. Mope. Kessier. And now Donk. So we're really not letting him get the ball without someone always being on his throat. Can he finish? Uh, oh, good save. They bail me out after bad defense. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. We got to work on our passing now. just above the box. Now so. with Spinazzola. And we've given the ball up a few times while we had possession. Traore. Ah, good center back bails him out there. Oh. Otherwise, Slavon. Not a free kick awarded by, by the referee. Traore. This opponent's not terrible. Kessier. Um, I'm used to playing you know, play ultimate team at this level. So a throw in here. Uh, you know. It's with a champion. Barella. Alert defending. Barella. Bad pass Every there. goalkeeper Wide would open. expect Hakeem to catch Hakeem. that one. Next time, players got to do better than that. Good dribble there. So, possession I'd changing hands. May even think this is a person's second account. Teo Hernandez now. They already have a main account. And Neil then they use the other That's eight accounts that you have on the Switch. Just create another ultimate team on because he's doing a few moves. He's obviously not a division one player. Francesco Acerbi. Hakimi. Uh, Traore. Traore with the foul. He pushed me away from the ball. So, yeah, this is definitely someone's uh, backup account. Well, they couldn't SPC keep it. Account. Kevin Malcui. The skill moves. Barella has it. Priority was to hang on and to the ball, cross. which he did. What you trying to head there? You were like four feet away from the wall. He's taken it away. Mm. And now Amiri. Can he convert? Well, what when the? all was said and done, he's failed. Like I tried to, to steal the, the ball and ended up getting a super lucky shot.
Barella has it and scope for them to produce something exciting. And the Perfect. referee takes the exception ball. to the challenge. Yes. Free kick. The referee has deemed that to be a bookable offence. Absolutely agree with that one. Amiri with it. Junior Kaisara. This guy does too many slow moves. That's his problem. Teo he Hernandez. Could have just it. He would have Spinazzola. It Kessier has it. Ah. Ooh. That was in the middle of the touch. That's calling a foul. He's not going to call a penalty in the back. Traore. Wataru Endo. Gotta remember, Bilotti's a big guy. Good so work to regain possession. Around, someone must have really pushed him. Kevin Malcui. Oh, he's lost possession. This guy sucks. He's good. Well, he lovely blocks. work to get past his man. Two passes automatically without being controlled. Kevin Malcui. That's a yellow. Well, that'll be a free last kick. Last defender. He's the last defender. Should be a yellow. So it doesn't agree, but should have been. Neil Mopé. Now with Akimi. And I must okay. say it's a fine looking attack, but what can they do from this Perfect position? Defense Options are plenty. Oh Jesus, you gotta shoot that. Tony Stone moves. Takes the shot. Finally oh, scores. Uh, and that scored is certainly not what they ago. wanted at this stage of the season, Lee. Well, time is running out. Defending has to be a priority in my book. This lot just don't seem to get it. They're in big trouble now. They're in big One trouble. And ball with the fingers, and the fingers. In possession, Velocity. And the ref through the whistle. Now the managers will now deliver progress. their halftime team talks. Oh. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. I don't agree with it. Uh, it's passing. We're beating him in every stat, uh, except for scoreline. So. You know, uh, as anticipated, it is what plenty it is. of talking points so far. And now the second half now play is the underway. All you want, but you have to score. In possession, Velocity. Leonardo Spinazzola. Uh, what is Ryan that? Donk. Junior Kaisara. Okay. Endo. Shot the ball from about two feet away and Teo Hernandez. Belotti. Oh, they'll be kicking themselves. Ruled yeah. offside. Hakimi. Kessier has it. Throw in, it's going to be Amiri with it. Mark Oot. Kessier was in the passing lane to block that. I guess, unfortunately, I did not block it. Um, no foul, hold there. Zlatan wide open, and Zlatan didn't open. Oh. Amiri with it. Neil Mopé, careless in possession. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Can they convert? Oh, it's in! And so that gets them all square, the but they've got to keep pushing Lee. Oh, they needed 
that. A lifeline, Derek, in this game. But can they find another one now? Well, here it is again. It looks a simple goal. He gets in a position not that far out from goal, but he has to hit the target. He does that, and it's in the back of the net. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. Well, the defending needed to... Real chance! Throw-ins given. All right, we get the throw in. Francesco Acerbi. Hernandez. Barella. Neil Come Mope. On. You pass better than that. Losing possession. Barella has it. Over the touchline right. for a throw in. Throw in again. Teo Hernandez. Leonardo Spinazzola. Oh, getting the ball forward. Wataru Endo. Can he find the net? Wow. And putting his body great, on the line. Great block by the uh, last defender there. To save that ball. On to Spinazzola. In possession, Velocity. Perfect shot. Uh, and that shot will be a corner. Times, even if I knew that was being saved. Uh, I would take that shot. Well, last line of defense, literally. Gives it a go. And both hands on it. Good Ooh. goalkeeping. This guy's getting bailed out by his goalkeeping and his last line defenders. That's a foul there. Free kick awarded. Sarachi has it. Wataru Endo. Amiri. Dead bounce there. Spot on with that tackle. Intercept that ball, but it's a dead bounce for us. Teo Hernandez. And play halted, free kick given. Wow, that's a bad. Didn't go anywhere where the, uh, the line was, or the circle, the other circle. What the? Can keep it. Teo Hernandez. Oh, his hurt. That was nice and easy one. for the keeper. I think everyone knew that was foul play. And the referee yeah, left with sucks. little choice but to award the free kick. He's lighting his injury. He's tired. Rightfully so. And he's won the ball. Kessier. Amiri with it. Well, they've lost the ball. Velocity, promising attack this. Can he finish? Not to be no in way. terms of the finish. No way. No way. Half power. Again, another shot I'll take. Saka. I did what I was supposed to do. Really getting stuck in defensively. Hakimi. Okay, so his random card was faster than small one. Saka. Can he convert? Well, somehow the goal. Oh, it's a goal! And, uh, and you get the shot down the corner. Good save. Oh, that could be the goal that saves the team. What a vital strike that is. 
Well, here is the replay. It's a well-taken goal. You had a sense that it was coming. The pressure's been mounting. But when you mount pressure on a team, you need to be patient as well. And they were, and they've got their reward. Well, foul play, says the referee. Conclusion, he's missed the opportunity. So three minutes of stoppage time it'll be. Neil Mopé. Well, that'll be a free kick. And the referee decided that intervention was illegal and cautionable. Oh, without question, it was not the best of challenges. Hernandez. So we take a, a very The final close whistle run. then, and that is that. Sure, Relegation staved one. off. They'll remain in this division next season. How do I look at the... Uh... I haven't played Ultimate Team in a year. So, uh, I played it three months ago, or whatever, but I haven't taken it serious in a year. How do I look at the overall stats? Is the overall stats? How do you how do you see where your shots were taken and all that? Like your passing percentage. Maybe that one. Uh, so again, just eight shots on target, all eight in the box. Beat him on possession, beat him on pass accuracy, um, beat him on tackles. I beat him on injuries. Uh, but the game was uh, much more one sided than this. <laughs> Scoreline shows. A uh, good opponent, though, for a Division 9. That's definitely his second opponent. Um, based on the skill moves that he was doing and the way he was playing. Uh, but you get the bonus episode of... Uh, of uh, Ultimate Team. So I think we're 5-0 and total on Ultimate Team. And I played four matches against the AI, I think against Team of the Week or whatever. And then this is my god squad. Watch out for these guys. They're all hurt. Everybody's hurt. But we'll get some more head-to-head -head matches. Uh, maybe later today or tomorrow. 